welcome to another edition of Achievement College, my step-by-step -step guide to getting you that gamer score. This is Aussie Gamer 17 and welcome to part 5 of my 100% walkthrough for Bug Snacks. Now, going into our quest log, we need to catch one sweet Frida for, for Cromdo. Now, if we head over to the left, this is at the entrance to the uh, Scorched Gorge. And we head to his area, and that's the uh, Frida up there. Oh, these guys are going to annoy me, are they? Uh, no, they actually won't. That's good where they are. Okay, I'm going to head up on these stairs where hopefully they won't... Uh... Oh, we can pick them both up. Perfect. If this happens, collect them both. And that's really only... Well, we need a spuddy for something later, but also just so they don't annoy me. Um, you don't really need them. We did pick up a spuddy in the last video, so you just need to make sure you can see down the bottom left there I've got three spuddies. You just need to make sure you've got at least one uh, Now we're gonna work on getting this guy the sweet Frida. Okay now He likes ketchup, but if we shoot ketchup at him right now and try and get him to come down. He's not gonna move it's hard to get him to sort of see it on the side and get him to come down. We want him to come down because what we're going to do is we're going to place a trap just somewhere about here somewhere. All right. Now, what we're actually going to do is we're going to shoot ketchup by getting this thing in here, having ketchup on, and we're going to press aim, uh, and we're going to shoot ketchup onto this guy, onto this, uh, what's he called? A cheap poof. So shoot ketchup onto him. Eventually, the sweet Frida is going to see that. He's going to get excited and he's going to crawl down the side here. Uh, and usually, uh, or sometimes I should say, he'll crawl into where we put the trap. He should end up in there eventually. Okay, he's going to be scared of us, is he? Alright, let's try and scare him away. He goes into our trap. There we go. If it doesn't work the first time, guys, you may just need to move the trap. Uh, but that's where I put it is usually a pretty good spot. All right, now that we've got that, we're going to go and... Oh, that is, by the way, number 21. That is our 21st Pokedex entry. And we're going to go uh, feed it to Frida. Make sure you select the sweet Frida. And again, I'm just going to put it on his arm and you'll know why uh, later in the game. In terms of why we're not putting it on, on his legs, that is. In fact... He's going to tell us something about it just now, I think. You're my best and only customer. I'm starting to think I should get a better location back in Snacksburg. Mmm. Moving all this inventory across the desert is real sweaty work. I'll need a way to keep cool. If you make both my feet into big bopsicles, uh, then walking the hot sands would be a breeze. But I got to warn you, you won't find bopsicles in the desert. Better look elsewhere, pal. <laughs> Yes, we are going to find some of those in the uh, next new area that we go to. Okay, so after speaking to Cromdo, making sure you've got a spuddy. If you haven't already got one, you need to go and get one now because we're going to need it where we're going next. We are going to open up our map and we're going to fast travel back to Snacksburg. Okay, and here in Snacksburg, we're gonna go find Good Wombus. Way. Usually in his farm, obviously. Do I need any? No. Evening. Do I need any ketchup? Yeah, we're gonna replace well at least one ketchup we just used. Don't need any chocolate. Speak to Wombus. Nothing yet. Think something might be wrong with the soil. It's the soil now. Maybe too wet. Either way, something needs fixing. Oh no, this. No. A big old fibrous bug snack, like a spuddy. Oh, like a spuddy? <laughs> uh, you mean uh, the spuddy I've already got? That's not for me. No, you go and feed that to Philbo. Right. And hold up by the outhouse for a spell. When his business is done, gather up wait. the fertilizer. Well, wait, 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 what, what do you mean? You know, uh, night soil. No, I don't know. No, 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 he doesn't, does he? He does. All right, go and find Philbo, and we're going to feed him. We're going to feed him a Spuddy. Spuddy. 
And doesn't matter where we put it. Let's uh, give him a spuddy leg. Awesome. He's happy. Good. Rightio. Oh, thanks for the gift, buddy. You are Suddenly, I'm feeling welcome. Oh, sorry, gotta go. Okay, it's going right through him. Follow him over. In my practice run, someone was already in there when we followed him over. Okay, this time it's empty. He's going to go in. Wait for him to come out. If someone's already in there and he doesn't end up actually going to the bathroom, you go in there and the fertilizer will be in there anyway, guys. Okay. Um, nothing to see here, Philbo. I'm just collecting some uh, fertilizer that happened to just be in the bathroom directly after you, immediately after you. Okay, go to Wombus with the fertilizer. That stink could yeah, yeah, I, ugh, yuck. That's bound to be potent enough for my soil. Thanks. Ugh. All right, so that completes his little side quest. We have done that. By the way, there are 38 side quests to complete for an achievement. And obviously, if you're following this guide, we're going to get through all of them as we go. Some will have to save till the end and some will do as we go. And now what we're going to go do is find the mill and find this little pathway next to the mill and head on over. And we're going to go to our new area, the Sugar Pine Woods. And here we are at the Sugar Pine Woods. Uh, we're going to scan these flying guys, the honeybees. And we're also going to scan... Hang on, where'd he go? Get our scanner ready. He's going to come back around. There he is. No, not the honey goop. This guy. The Quookie, some cooler, or a cool, no, some cool achievements coming up shortly with those guys. Uh, we can also grab a new, uh, I guess, condiment, peanut butter, and we can also scan this guy, the Sinner Snail, more on him in a moment. Uh, get some more peanut butter, head over here, you can scan this guy here, not the, uh, yeah, the big popsicle, scan him. Um, all right, that'll do for now for this little area. We'll catch some of those guys in a minute, guys. But first, we're going to head up here and we're going to run into this NPC that we met in the last video. Snorpy? Chandlo. Snorpy. And another one. Oh, Snorpy, get out here. I'm sorry, Chandlo. I'm not coming outside. I'm this close to finishing my next invention. Return to your lifting in peace. Snorpy, we talked about this, bro. You gotta go outside at least one hour a day. Gotta get some fresh air, dog. That's a very good point. I wonder if I'll get some fresh air today or I'll just do this all day. Who? There's nobody out here but us, bro. Better to work in the shadows when I cannot be seen. Also, it's cold out there. Bro, if you're not coming outside, I'm bringing the outside to you. What do you mean, Chandlo? What's he doing? No, what, what? You cannot lift my entire house. Oh, yes, he can. Oh, yes, I can. I'm going to lift your crib, dog. Do not lift my crib, Chandlo. I have delicate instruments in here and... Lift in your crib, dog. I actually did a workout yesterday. I fresh air. I can smell the country. And I'm sore today, so I think I'll just do this all day. That's right, bro. One step at a time. It's my Saturday today, so I can uh, sit here and do this all day, can't I? Okay, once we've done that, what you want to do is try and speak to Snorpy. You he won't. Wrong, interloper. Whatever sort of spy or counter agent you are, I'm not about to fall for your tricks. I'm not a spy? What are you talking about? Well, I kind of am. I'm a journalist. They're like spies, aren't they? Talk to Chanlo. Whoa, it's you again. How's that sweet mountain air treating you, bro? Pretty good, bro. Easy to stay swollen in paradise. Easy for me, anyway. I'm Chandlo Funk Bun. With wisdom and lifting, <laughs> I got the full package. Whoa, bro, yeah. Will you come back to Snacksburg? Nah, I'm good. I mean, I like being in town, but it gives Snorpy mad anxiety. Why don't you talk to him? He's not good with strangers, so tell him I sent you. <laughs> Sounds good. All right. Back to Snorpy again. Oh, he did, did he? Yes, he did. My poor sweet Chandler has always been too trusting. What is your business with me? 
Uh, we want you to come back to Snacksburg. Hmm. I'm not disinterested, but you're still a suspicious individual. No, I'm not. I propose a test. Here, take my newest invention, the Snack Grappler. Excellent. I could help Chandler with his basketballing problem. But I forgot that meant going outside, so you do it, and then maybe we'll talk. Okay. Help Chanlo with his basketball problem. Sounds good. Back to Chanlo again. Nice, dog. I knew he'd warm up to you. All right, follow me. Follow old mate Chanlo. Bro. Follow him down. And talk once again. Check it out. My own personal dunk zone. Problem is, I lost my balls. They're stuck. You lost your balls? Did I'm you sure does your I girlfriend have them? Without your help. <laughs> I had to say it. Thing for me and I want to see it in action. <laughs> now you'll see over there a uh, snail. We've already scanned one of those and we'll get to him in just a moment. Uh, first we have to get out the uh, snack grappler. And we need to grab his basketballs and put them in the uh, basket. There's one up here, so let's grab this one first. Up to the right, and go and pop it in this uh, container here. Grab that one. Pop it in the container. And then grab the one over in the tree. And pop that in there as well. There we go. Did that fall out? Nope, they're all in there. Excellent. Go speak to Chanlo again. All right, you Your balls are back. back. That grapple thing is awesome. I agree. I bet it can grab all kinds of stuff. Snorpy's a genius, bro. Check it out. There's a cine snail right over there. Sure is. I know it looks like a sticky dump truck full of cars, but it's actually a master climber. Even I can't keep up with it. I always wanted to climb like that. See if you can catch me that sinner snail, bro. Alrighty, uh, that's a good plan. Okay, but we actually can't do it like this. Like, that doesn't work, guys. That's what you're, the game's trying to trick you there. What we're going to do is we're going to put down our launching pad right about there. We are then going to put the trap on top of the launching pad. And we're going to send the trap over to the snail and Grab activate. The trap, dog. And then we're going to use the grappler to grab the Sinner Snail. There we go, the Sinner Snail is uh, Pokedex entry number 22. Put that away, pick that up, put it away, and speak to Chanlo yet again. Uh, wait on, no. Later, dog. Oh, we're gonna feed it, sorry. Feed him the Sinner Snail. Put it on one of his arms, I guess, because that's gonna help him climb, I assume. Oh, yeah. I feel stronger already. Nice. I'm right out of here. Race you back to the cabin. What do you mean? Where are you going? How do I get it? I want to climb. How do I get up there? Uh, um, okay, no. Of course I know how to get out. We're going to pop down our launchy pad. We're going to hop on the launch pad. And we're going to aim up the hill. In that spot. Not in that spot. Hang on. We're going to get the, there. When you see it like that, that's where you want to launch. And then you want to retrieve the launch pad. And then you want to pop it right here. Stand on it. Aim up and over and launch. There we go. And retrieve it yet again. Excellent. Uh, put that away and head over and talk to Chanlo again. Nice, you made it. You got back pretty fast for a newbie. Me, I got the same time I always get. I guess one bug snack isn't enough to push my limits. There's got to be more sinus snails around this mountain, dog. Oh, there is. I already seen one. You want me to go get it? Oh, okay. We'll go catch two sinus snails. Uh, now, it isn't night time. Usually when I get up to here, it's night time and there's another flying um, creature here to scan. If you see him, give him a scan, but it's not to worry. We, we have to um, see him later. He's part of the uh, the main quest line, so don't worry too much. And what we're going to do here is we're going to catch this guy. 
That's in a snail. And we're going to do it the same way we caught the last one. We're going to pop this here. We're going to pop the trap on top. We're going to aim across. Not on the rock. Aim for the snail. Send it over. Activate. Grab our little uh, thingamajig out and catch another sinner snail. And then pick this up and put it away. Okay, now it is achievement time, guys. You want to hop down without triggering the uh, this guy down here. We've already scanned him, haven't we? You, yeah, obviously we have. His trail's there. Do not go near him. We don't want him coming over here and interrupting what we do. All right, here's the achievement we're going to work on here, guys. Uh, we're going to be getting our achievement for catching a certain number of um, bug snacks, but the achievement we're going for here is for catching two bug snacks in one trap. Our main priority is to catch the snail. Um, so we're going to put a trap right here. And then what we want to do is use chocolate to lure the snail down. The other thing that lures with the chocolate is this guy, the cookie. So we're going to lure them both. He's going to start passing out, like by running into the trap, he sort of knocks himself out. The snail makes his way down and we need to time it right so that we catch them both in the trap. That's the plan. So I'm going to shoot some chocolate here to sort of get the snail to come down. And then I'm going to shoot some chocolate right there at the rock. And the cookie should head on over when he sees it. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. He didn't see it. All right, let's put some chocolate there and put some chocolate there. Put some chocolate there. Get ready with the trap. Cookie's coming over. Knocks himself out. We catch them both. And pick it all up. And we'll get the achievement. There we go. So that is the double trapper achievement. Catch more than one bug snack in your snack trap at once. And I just realized that's actually only number 23 or 24. We're going to find out in just a second. Because now what we're going to do is catch some of these hunter bees. Oh, and there's the other guy I was talking about before. So scan him. That's the char mallow, but more on those later. For now, what we want to do is catch two hunter bees. And we need those for something in just a moment. So it's quicker if we just catch them now. And the way we're going to do that is by placing down the launch pad. And the trap on top of the launch pad. And then something I learned in between this video and the last video is if you aim and you actually lock onto one of these enemies and then launch, you're gonna have a better time trying to catch a flying enemy with this method. So launch. And when you see the uh, see it light up, catch it. Oh, now you might have actually knocked another one out of the sky so you can catch two for one. There's the quartermaster for catching 25 unique species. I really thought I was only up to 24, but that's the achievement anyway for Hey, why has he got the timer on over there? Let's go see what that's all about. Oh, there's two more of them. We have no room. We're full. So they can get back in the air. Let's pick up our uh, launch pad. And with that all done, we're going to head up and see. Uh, we need to feed two uh, sinner snails to... What's his face anyway? So let's go do that. Feed him the two snails first. Uh, sure, you can have a whole snail arm and feed him one more. Uh, where do you want that? Um, let's just go with right foot. You've got a, a right side of your body. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I can't wait to check my gains. But before that, I got a situation. Honeybees flew off with my backup balls. Now my balls are up in the sky. No matter how shredded I get, I can't fly. Believe me. You've tried. <laughs> I tried. You gotta be my wings, dog. Master that grabber. Catch me those honeybees. I don't know how to catch honeybees with the grabber. Maybe I just haven't learnt that yet. Uh, but either way, we are going to feed Chandlo two honeybees that we've already caught. Uh, feed that. <laughs> Uh, what do you reckon? Give him a honeybee. Hang on. I'm trying to get to the left hand. Left hand? Sure. And then feed him another honeybee. 
Left arm. You've got a honeybee arm, dude. I don't think that's going to help you fly, though. Body's tingling. I think that's the power. Bro, you really did me a solid. If you want me back in town, I'll be there. But I ain't going anywhere without my main dog, Snorpy. He'd be lost without me. I can't get Snorpy to leave, though. Whatever's keeping him here, he doesn't want to talk to me about it. Says it's a secret project. And he won't tell you. I have a feeling he'll talk to you. Why would he tell me and not you? You're his buddy. But anyway, let's get in here and speak to Snorpy. Chandler said you have a secret project. Uh, yes. I wish I could tell Chandler everything. But knowing the truth would only put him in more danger. Anyway, you have my thanks for helping him. Perhaps I can trust you. Of course you can. I am Snorpington Fizzlebean, engineer and seeker of truths. Here, new chum, lean in close so that I may bestow a hug on you. What? Ah. What? This seems like a trick. Why are you hugging me? Ah, what you weirdo. What <laughs> experience that was. We shall have to do that many more times. Now, I need your help. Are you willing to risk your life for the greater good? Um, no. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> there is I said no. Place you will need. I've hidden it inside the Bugwatch Tower. Once you have it, I will tell you more. <laughs> okay, let's go get that. Uh, so back out of here, head out this way under this uh, rock Hello? formation, Hello? and up Can this. Can you hear me? Oh, right. I'm trying to talk to my viewers. Shush. On you during our mutual hugging. Now we can I knew it. Beware. Grumpinati are always listening. <laughs> the Grumpinati. All right, up this hill where this tower is, guys. Get the scanner out and scan this dude. Not going to catch him just now, uh, but we'll uh, pop that away. And we want to get on top of the tower by standing on this thing. Wee! All right, up we are. Up we go, and we get the newest contraption, the uh, tripwire thingamajiggy. And guys, this thing helps us catch a lot of things that we haven't been able to catch yet. Pardon the interruption guys, but I just wanted to let you know that it takes a hell of a lot of work to make these guides and walkthroughs that I make on my channel. I need all the support I can get from you bloody legends out there. So please hit the join button to become a member of my YouTube channel, or you can join my Patreon by going to patreon.com forward slash AussieGamer17. Thanks for the help, you bloody legends. We're going to deploy it right here on top of this box, and then we're going to aim at this here and I was just a bit too slow there because we need to wait for that guy to come back around so just uh, shoot the little target thingamajiggy and when he flies back around he's gonna get tripped by the tripwire and fall down there where we won't be able to catch him because two things you need to do you need to stun him and cool him off if you want to catch the uh, what are they called again Charmello. for now it's just about getting out of here oh my god I accidentally walked into my own tripwire let me just do that again. And then I'll speed up the video while we wait for this uh, guy to come back around. There we go. Don't worry about trying to go down there and catch him. You won't be able to. If you go near him right now, oh, fall down, you'll uh, just set yourself on fire. So let's uh, just run back to old mate Snorpy. And just remembering that we've already got, if we go into our backpack before we do anything else, you've already got a Queeble. Uh, not a Queeble, a Cookie. I think that's what it's called, isn't it? A Cookie um, that we caught with that achievement that we did earlier. Ah, chum, I have such a craving for Cookies. Why, my craving is so terrible that I would like my teeth to be Cookies so that I may taste my own teeth, you see. Rightio, fancy that. We've already got ourselves a cookie. So let's use that on old mate. And put it on his teeth as he requested. Ah. <laughs> Splendid. I no longer have to worry about psychotronic torture or cavities. But now I hunger for charmallows. Can't ever have enough charmallows. <laughs> And the Charm Mallows, we're going to grab in the next video. We're going to use the tripwire to get a lot of uh, uh, bug snacks that we couldn't get before, guys. There's some Charm Mallows around. So we'll do that at the start of the next video 
here in, uh, what's it called, uh, the uh, Sugar Pine Woods. Can't wait for that. Hope you're enjoying the series, guys. If you are, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, post a comment, and of course, subscribe. There's the bell. You know what that means. Class dismissed.